Good morning, LCA Preschool. It's Miss Caitlin reading to you. This morning, our book is Marisol McDonald Doesn't Match. My name is Marisol McDonald, and I don't match. At least, that's what everyone tells me. I play soccer with my cousin Tato, and he says, Marisol, your skin is brown like mine, but the, your hair is the color of carrots. You don't match. Actually, my hair is the color of fire, I say, and I kick the ball over Tato's head and into the gold. My brother says, Marisol, those pants don't match that shirt. They clash. But I love green polka dots and purple stripes. I think they go great together, don't you? I also love peanut butter and jelly burritos and speaking Spanish, English, and sometimes both. Can I have a puppy, a furry sweet perrito? I ask my parents, por favor. Quizás, mommy says. Maybe, dad says, smiling and winking. My teacher, Miss Apple, doesn't like the way I sign my name. Marisol McDonald, she says, this doesn't match. At school, we learn to print and use cursive, but not at the same time. But I like the way Marisol McDonald looks when I write it. At recess, Ollie and Emma want to play pirates, and Noah wants to play soccer. How about soccer playing pirates, I suggest. No way, they say. So I run off to play on the swings by myself. After recess, we have art, my favorite subject. I think my drawings surprise my friends. At lunch, Ollie walks over and to me and scrunches his nose. Peanut butter and jelly burrito, he says. I know, I know, I say it doesn't match, but it sure tastes good. Marisol, you couldn't match even if you wanted to, Ollie says. Oh yeah, I bet I can. The next day, I wake up and decide that today, I, Marisol McDonald, will match. This is a little hard to find clothes that are still the same color. I play pirates with Ollie at recess, but it's not very fun. Why can't pirates play soccer anyway? I have a regular peanut butter and jelly sandwich at lunch and the bread just tastes, well, mushy. Even art class is a little bit boring. Marisol, Miss Apple says, what's wrong? This doesn't look like your usual work. I'm trying to match, I say with a frown. Why, asks Miss Apple. I can't think of a single good reason. At the end of the day, Miss Apple hands me a note. Marisol, I want you to know that I like you just the way you are because the Marisol McDonald that I know is creative, unique, bilingual, Peruvian, Scottish, American, soccer playing artist, and simply marvelous, Miss Janico Apple. And I skip all the way home. When I wake up on Saturday, I put on my pink shirt, my polka dot skirt, my favorite hat, and the one that my abuelita brought me from Peru. At breakfast, I say, my name is Marisol McDonald, and I don't match because I don't want to. Bravo, says mommy. Good for you, says dad. Now let's go to the pound and get a puppy. When we get to the pound, there are big dogs and little dogs. There are dogs with long noses and dogs with smushed faces. There are chocolate colored puppies and smoke gray puppies and puppies the color of caramel. Which one will I ever choose? Then I see him. He has one floppy ear and one pointy ear, one blue eye and one brown eye. He is beautiful. I walk over and he leaps into my lap. I cuddle him and it sounds like he purrs. I think I found just the right dog for you, Marisol, mommy says. My puppy is perfect. He's mismatched and simply marvelous, just like me. I think I'll name him Kitty.